way human beings function, I, I suppose I, I kind of see people as animals, you know, and we might be, we're very kind of elaborate animals, but we're still just animals and all our, all of our complexity still springs out from these very basic kind of bodily urges, um, you know, sex, violence, domination, submission, um, and as complex as culture and, and societies get, that's always the undercurrent, that's the, that's the motivating force behind everyone's actions. And I suppose some of this is just trying to, trying to strip away all that finery and just show, show what people are, you know. It's just like when you see bodies in contemporary culture, this is an interesting one, like, it used to be, until quite recently, the only time you saw a nude was in a piece of art. Now the only time anyone sees a nude is in pornography, and they tend to be these idealised bodies that practically nobody actually has. Um, so yeah, I mean, it's just to, to represent some reality, like rather than this, you know, this kind of idea we have of ourselves. Again, I suppose it's trying to get back to the animality, like with all that, all that idealisation, just stripped right back, like and taken out, and go, this is your your wretched state, you know.